if you could have any godfather in the world, which godfather would it be? Now, I've been studying Greek mythology for a little while now. And obviously, because I've been doing that, my my favorite godfather would be Zeus. Now, maybe Zeus was kind of a jerk when he was a god of Olympus, or he still is. But that doesn't stop him from being a really great godfather, and I can give you a few reasons why. Here we go. Hope you enjoy the video. Now, Zeus's parents were Rhea and Cronus. I could tell you about the story where Zeus had to overthrow Cronus, but, you know. His siblings were Hesta, Demeter, Hera, Hades, and Poison, and he was actually from Mount Dicte, where his uh, mom, Rhea, hid him from Cronus. Now, why Rhea hid Zeus is a different question, and that's about to be answered. Rhea hid Zeus because Cronus was going to eat him. Cronus didn't trust his children because there was a prophecy called the Oracle that said one of his children would overthrow him from the throne. So he ate all of his children, but then Zeus came along, Rhea wrapped a rock in baby clothes, and then she hid him in either a cave or with Mother Nature, whichever myth you believe. And then mostly eventually, Zeus did overthrow Cronus from the throne and made him puke out all the other siblings. Now, Zeus has a really weird family tree. His parents were Cronus and Rhea, who got married because they were siblings to Gaia and Uranus. And also, Zeus got married to his sister, Hera. As king of the gods, Zeus had many special talents. Some was forming weather, fighting. He's also the god of the sky, like I said. Well, I didn't say that earlier. He liked to hurl thunderbolts, too, at people who upset him. And liars. So, he has quite a bit of special skills, too. Now, his skills are fighting, forming weather. And, well, he did with his shield the Aegis. The Aegis... Here is an image of the Aegis. Now, the Aegis is Zeus's shield, like I said, like five seconds ago. But... It has Medusa's face on it. Eventually, he gave the shield to Athena, goddess of wisdom, creator of the old olive tree. Oh yeah, one other thing about Zeus, he had he had one trait. He liked to chase after women. Yeah. He um he once he had this wife, his first wife, and like what happened with with her was um he. She didn't like him, so she um, turned herself into an animal. She shapeshifted, and so then Zeus shapeshifted, and then he caught her, and then she eventually, you know, got married with him. But then they broke up, and then Zeus did it again with some other woman, and then Zeus did it again with another woman until he got to Hera. And then he just cheated on Hera. His weaknesses were also he was so arrogant and full of himself. And his areas that caused trouble was he loved women, and he had a bad temper, and he liked throwing lightning bolts at people. Despite all of Zeus's disadvantages, there is still a few reasons why I'd love him to be my godfather. One of the reasons is he's a great protector. Like, really great. See, um, Zeus is the, is the leader of the heavens, ruler of the heavens, ruler of all gods. He could, um... He could save me at any time, and even, even if something bad did happen to me, well, I would know I would be in a safe place. Anyways, he also likes to keep the peace, which is a good thing. He is a lawmaker. He can make really great laws to keep us humans safe. And he is he can also protect us from no death and no hurt. So, like, so... Let's just say he could protect us from death if he was your godmother, but obviously he's mine. 